What is up everybody? So this is our eight question series on word problems. These are eight questions you absolutely must know for the PSAT, SAT, and ACT. Let's get into it. Here we've got one of those questions that when we look at it, a lot of times we say, okay, what am I supposed to do here? Like figure out calendars, am I supposed to count? Here's what we have. It says, if today is Friday, what day will it be 44 days from now? So absolutely, you could list out Friday, Saturday, Sunday, you could write out your whole week and then count 44 days, but that's definitely not the most efficient way to do this. Here's the first thing you wanna keep in mind. If today is Friday, what day is it gonna be a week from today, seven days from now? It's gonna be Friday again. And seven days from then, it'll be Friday again. So here's what we're gonna do. We know that there's seven days in a week and we know that we wanna get up to 44 days. So let's divide out 44 by seven. So here's what we're gonna get. If we do 44 divided by seven, and notice I'm gonna be writing this with an actual remainder. So here's what we have. Seven goes into 44 six times. That gives us 42. And when we subtract, what do we have? Six remainder two. What does that mean? To get to 44 days, we have to go six weeks plus two days. So if we go six weeks, remember every week, what day do we keep landing on? We keep landing on another Friday. So at the end of six weeks, we'll be at Friday again, but we have to go two more days. So we're gonna go Friday, Saturday, Sunday. So the answer here is definitely answer choice C. Questions like this are all about patterns. So what do you have to do? Make sure that you identify the pattern. And here, what was the pattern? The fact that every seven days, we landed on a Friday, right? So that's the part that's really important. The long division also helps us, so we're not actually counting all those days up to 44 days. So with questions like this, just be careful, because here our answer was Sunday. Obviously, Saturday and Monday are also there as answers. They're there to trip us up, so you just gotta make sure you're careful with your work. All right, guys, thank you so much for hanging out with me. Make sure to watch the rest of the videos in this series to get the help that you need for the PSAT, SAT, and ACT. And make sure to check out our other series. And if you haven't already, like and subscribe because this is obviously the best thing that's ever happened to SAT prep. <laughs> there we go. And I like love it. I think yeah. that's the one.